nossas palmas. Maria, Maria, Negra Maria, Negra Maria, Negra Maria, Negra Maria. Bishops of each country have to watch this, knowing that the aim. The reason for mass, the reasons are for adoration, contrition, thanksgiving, and asking for what we need. If the movements help towards that, yes. If they do not, no. Now, if you say dance in Europe and in North America, people think of Saturday evening, ballroom dance, one man, one woman. And it is all right as recreation. But we do not come to Mass to enjoy. We don't come to Mass to admire people and clap for them and say, repeat, repeat, wonderful, excellent. That is all right for the auditorium, for the theater, even for the parish hall. Presuming that the dance is acceptable from moral point of view, because there are some dances that are wrong everywhere. <laughs> Even in the parish hall and in the theater, they are wrong because they are provocative unnecessarily. So, and also in Africa and Asia, every dance is not acceptable. There are some dances that are totally not acceptable in any religious event. So it, it differs. But as for North America or Europe, we think that the dance should not enter the liturgy at all. And the people discussing liturgical dance should spend that time saying the rosary. <laughs> uh, or they should spend that time reading one of the documents of the Pope on the Holy Eucharist. We have already enough, we have already enough problems. Why banalize more? Why desacralize more? Haven't we already enough confusion? Yeah. Amen. If you want to admire a dance, you know where to go. But not mass. And then the, the not other... you, of course. It's other people. Yeah. <laughs> um, and then the secular music, you know, not... Ah, yes. Obviously, every music has its own setting. We come to Mass for, again, those four reasons I mentioned. Does that music mean adoration of God or praise of God or asking pardon for our sins and the reparation or begging God for what we need? Recreation is very different. Okay. The, you know, the maestro who gesticulates and makes funny movements, most of them unnecessary. And then he finishes, he makes a, bit, a deep bow, and there's a standing ovation. That's good for theater, but not for mass. <laughs> Young people's rock music, they enjoy, enjoy, is good for picnic, <laughs> but not for mass. Everything has its proper place. Therefore, the bishops of each area should get a good music commission so that they have music book containing Catholic hymns so that only Catholic hymns are sung because what we sing should manifest what we believe and should nourish our faith and not just sing anything it should be theologically deep liturgically rooted and musically acceptable unfortunately Many things sung in some Catholic churches should not figure at all. <laughs>